How's it going lads? Welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video what I have for you is an SBC solution. This is the Wants to Watch Gelson Martins SBC. Now let me first of all start off by saying I personally do not think this SBC is that worth it. Um, you need an 83 rated squad and an 85 rated squad. And I personally don't think for an 82 rated Wants to Watch item that isn't tradable, that's worth it. And we only get a 25k players pack and a 35k mega pack for both squads. So I don't think personally it's that worth it for what you have to submit. Unless you have a really good and tradable club like myself, I personally just don't see the worth in it. Um, so this is the solution I went for with the uh, with the Sporting CP squad. The way I saw it is everyone, literally everyone's got at least a couple of decent rated UCL cards in their club at the minute. Uh, and the people that are going to be completing this SBC are the kind of people that are going to have decent clubs with decent coin values. So I went and put in a couple of UCL cards for both teams because I thought... If you don't have, if you have a UCL card of a similar rating, you can find a way to put him in there to get the chemistry. Um, so this is where I went. We went with the Compton goal. I went with Glick and Rami, Digne and Danny Alves. I also went with uh, Cesc Fabregas, Wijnaldum and Jorginho across the midfield. Bernardo Silva, Dost and Juan Mata. In terms of price, um, probably about twenty-five to thirty-five thousand coins cost me for all of the players, not including the UCL cards. Including the UCL cards, probably about forty-five, fifty k maybe. Like I said, it's not really a worth it SBC in my opinion. However, uh, I went and completed it anyway, just to show you guys uh, how much I paid pretty much for everyone. It wasn't too bad to be fair. Um, it's pretty decent, and uh, I'd get on Dost quick if I were you, because a lot of people will be trying to get Dost straight away. So we go ahead and uh, submit that. We got ourselves a premium gold players pack. Now for loss, I don't even know. Los Colconeros, I think. This is how I, was, uh, I completed it. Now, it's it's difficult. This is the base uh, amount of cards in terms of rating that I could get. I couldn't I couldn't go any ratings lower. Uh, we went with Handanovic and goal. Carvajal, Raul Albiol, Skriniar, and Felipe. Uh, Gelson Martins, Danilo Pereira, Pizzi, and Brahimi. Diego Costa, and Jonas. And it was pretty cheap for me. It won't be as cheap for you guys. In terms of price... I honestly don't have a clue how much this is valued at, but for an 85 rated squad, it's pretty expensive. Um, unless you want to go with all 85s, it's probably the cheapest way you're going to get it. So I went and completed it this way. Uh, luckily, I had an untradeable club full of high rated players, so it helped me out with the SBC. Um, I know a lot of you guys probably won't be as lucky as I am, so we'll go ahead and submit that, and, and we've finished it. We've completed the SBC for the ones to watch, Gelson Martins, which is uh, it's pretty decent, if you ask me. Pretty happy with it. Obviously, we get the 82 rated ones to watch card and he gets to walk out of a pack, which I think is pretty cool. Um, I, I really like this feature. I like the feature of them uh, making players walk out of packs pretty much. Uh, I don't know why. It's just, it's just a nice touch. It's just a very nice touch. Uh, to have it on the SBCs, and uh, I just think that, that's that's really cool, if you ask me. That's really cool. So uh, let's get straight into the packs. So obviously we get the Gelson Martins card, which is, you know, it's all well and good, but we want, we want to see the reward packs for this. Now, I also want to show you guys the weekly objective. Um, we have a really cool weekly objective this week, and it is, uh, where is it? There we go. We get a Verdi card, an 84 rated Verdi card. You have to score with a Serie R player five in, in five separate rival wins to get ones to watch Verdi. In my opinion, not only is that really easy, but it's a really good card as well because he already got an upgrade, so I think that's pretty cool. He also uh, completed the, the good deals one, which get a silver pack for. So, you know what? It's it's a pretty good uh, what Verdi, ones to watch Verdi to get from, from weekly objectives. So, I'm not against that at all. But I would refrain from completing Gelser Martin, 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 Martin. I've... I've F that up royally. I would refrain from completing Gelson though, unless you have a really stacked club. Because in my opinion, it really just isn't worth it. Even if he does get a couple of upgrades, I just cannot put the value on there. So, we get a board drop, thankfully, in our first pack. It's William Carvalho. Not too shabby. It's an 84 raid card. I think he'll actually sell for a bit as well. Thank you to this SBC. So, um, not bad at all. We'll take that. We also get Dembele and Marcus Alonso. Not bad at all. Actually, it's a really good pull. So, um, William Carvalho is currently selling for. I'm going to go on Footbin just to, to make sure I have the uh, the proper value for these cards so I can tell you guys exactly how much I'm making. So, uh, William Carvalho, 3,500 coins. I'm going to list him up for that. Uh, Usmane Dembele, I think st still goes for like maybe five to 7K. Something like that. No, he doesn't. He sells for 3,000 coins now. That's fantastic. We'll, uh, we'll sell him for that. And then Marcus Alonso. I have no idea how much Marcus Alonso is currently going for. We'll have to have a look. He is currently going for... 
8.4K. Marcus Alonso goes for more than Usmane Dembele. And I didn't even get excited when I saw Marcus Alonso because I had no idea how much he goes for. And I just royally messed that up. There we go. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll sell him for that. We'll just store the rest and discard Fabio Contrao. On to the 35K Mega Pack. Can we get a walk out of here? That is the question. Can we get something good? No walkout, sadly. Anything decent, though. It's going to be a board. That's good news. It's going to be Croatian. Goalkeeper. Subasic. Pretty crap. Pretty bad. I was hoping that I'd say centre mid because I think Mandzukic is in form. So it would have been Mandzukic. Regardless, that's pretty awful. Uh, hopefully, there's any. is there any redeeming factors in the pack? Uh, not really. Uh, it's a pretty, pretty poor pack. 3,000 coins. We'll take that and we'll, uh, we'll discard the rest. Anyway, lads, that is it for this video. If you guys did enjoy, smash the like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new around here. And I'll see you later.